Hi Dr. Sandeep and Dr. Bharat. My uncle has been advised minimally invasive lung cancer surgery. What is its importance? Lung cancer surgery has been there for a very long time, but it was being performed with an open wound. Open wound in for lung cancer means you are opening the chest and opening the chest simply means breaking the ribs very often. Now when ribs are cut, it means that the person is going to have lifelong pain. What has changed over the time? The techniques and technology is what has changed. Now in the past 15 to 20 years, the technology, the camera technology, the vision technology has to changed to that extent that we have what are called as laparoscopic systems, we have what are called as robotic systems. These systems provide us with high definition videos, sometimes a three dimensional video. And now these technologies are being implemented even for chest and with far better result than the results of open surgery. What is the advantage? We totally avoid the problems related to the opening of chest. There is no fracture of rib. There are no big wounds. There is no much blood loss. So there are many, many other advantages. So the patient recovers much faster, breathes much easier. There's no lifelong pain in the chest. So there are many advantages that minimally invasive surgery gives. The word minimally invasive or the phrase minimally invasive means minimal means less invasion means the wound. So which are the techniques which give this advantage? In simple words, there is something called thoracoscopy, which is putting a scope means a camera into the chest that is thoracoscopic surgery. There is something called VATS, which is video assisted thoracoscopic surgery, which means, you know, we are putting a little bigger incision than plain thoracoscopy. Robotic technology, wherein we use the specialized robotic system to reach the corners which are difficult to reach otherwise. So there are many techniques which have come into this. The variations of similar technologies to use a camera and get a better vision of the chest and give a better result. We have today proof that these patients who have undergone the minimally invasive surgeries do better than those who have undergone open surgeries. Even in the short term, that means in the immediate recovery from this surgery, as well as in terms of cancer cure, there is enough proof today to say that the minimally invasive fares better. So lung cancer surgery can be done via the conventional open method or the minimally invasive method. Why do we need minimally invasive surgery for lung cancer? Is because open surgery involves a big wound which has a, a lot of pain associated with it and which delays the recovery of the patient. So what is minimally invasive surgery? If the same surgery can be done by putting very small incisions like a 5 mm or a 10 mm incision and the entire surgery can be completed, the patient's recovery will be fast and his pain will be less. So this is possible by minimally invasive surgery. What are the types of minimally invasive surgery? So there are two types of minimally invasive surgery. One is video assisted thoracoscopic surgery. The other is the robotic surgery. So the advantages of minimally invasive surgery is in terms of less pain, shorter hospital stay, less blood loss, earlier removal of the drain, earlier recovery to work and also in some studies there has been reports of improved overall survival. So robotic surgery offers few specific advantages in, when compared to VAT surgery in terms of the three-dimensional vision, the magnification, the precision, accuracy and also the dexterity uh, compared to the straight instruments of the VATs.